Okay, today we're going to do a demonstration for you on a Sunnen ML5000 horizontal honing machine. Uh, this machine obviously has a control panel here for the operator where you could set various controls and feed rates and speeds. Uh, you have the work area here which is uh, enclosed for safety. You've got a foot pedal here to start your cycle for setting up and uh, really can't do a complete automatic cycle because the machine senses right away that there's no component there's actually no mandrel right now or uh, this is equipped with a size control gauge on here uh, so you really need to be running this machine uh, you can't just perform dummy cycles other than uh, a, sh a brief little so in that little cycle there you have the spindle running and you have the stroker going we do have with this machine uh, this mechanism here, which, which I saw you recognize, it goes on here. Uh, if you want to bring the camera around to the right side of the machine, we can show you some stuff going on in there. Well, I can't turn this all the way, but all I'm going to do is just hit the cycle start, and you'll see the things moving back and forth there. On the other side, the feed for the stones is automatically advanced each time I do this. Now, if you did it with the foot pedal, um, you would have to advance the stones manually, so that's the difference there. Uh, so there you have it, it's a pretty clean machine, it's 220 volts, of course it needs air. Pretty small footprint for a, for a machine like this. That's your Sunnen ML5000 horizontal honing machine. Oh, and one more thing, this uh, whole front unit here uh, pulls out of here, this, is, this contains the entire pump for the machine, as well as all of the um, honing floor. In fact, it looks exactly like the unit we have here because we have almost an identical machine. So this is what you have inside there. You have your pump and it plugs into here. It comes out for easy maintenance and easy cleaning and then just slides back into the front of the machine and it's on wheels. Now this does not belong to the machine we're doing a video on. I'm just showing you that that's what you have here. You can adjust, you can adjust your, your work area by pulling this back and forth and pushing it in close if you're working on smaller parts. Okay, so uh, that's about it. Thank you very much.